Uh, so in Kenya, we have some of the best uh, technical training uh, institutes or uh, rather technical colleges. You can also refer to them as uh, polytechnics uh, that provides uh, students chances of actually enrolling and pursuing uh, some of the very marketable technical uh, courses. Now when we talk about uh, these particular technical uh, training institutes, uh, they have actually uh, come in hand to assist those people who didn't maybe uh, got or uh, rather uh, managed to get the right uh, university uh, degrees, or rather university recommended uh, qualifications such as maybe they got less than C minus or C minus, B plus and so on. So they normally find themselves enrolling uh, for this particular uh, technical training institute. So if you are outside there and you're wondering uh, maybe which course to pursue, you need to check on this best uh, technical training institute. So I'll just highlight some of the best uh, 15 uh, technical training institutes. As you can see, we have Mukureini uh, Technical Institute. So this uh, particular uh, TTI offers quite a number of courses, as you can see, right? So majorly, as uh, the name suggests, uh, it provides uh, technical co uh, courses, right? So if you want to become, for instance, a plumber, uh, electrical engineer, a mechanical, if you want to do mechanical engineer and so on, uh, you can check with these um, crane, right? So that's one of the uh, technical training institute that we have. Uh, we also have uh, the Kenya Coast Polytechnic. Uh, they also offer various technical courses, right? So if you check on the academics, you can see they have different departments, uh, mechanical engineering, uh, building and civil engineering, hospitality and tourism. So you can be rest assured that uh, this particular technical institute is going to give you uh, the much needed uh, technical courses. And these particular courses are going to enable you uh, not only secure a job, but you can only start your own uh, self-employment, right? So uh, ideally, if you can get access to Kenya Coast National Polytechnic, then uh, you can enroll for those particular uh, courses that you have seen. Uh, we also have uh, Kenya, or rather current technical training institute for the deaf, right? So if you want to specialize on those particular uh, courses that allow you to maybe uh, handle uh, maybe things such as uh, communication, sign languages, then uh, you need to check on this particular uh, training institute. It also has different academic uh, department, like you can see building and constructions, carpa uh, carpentry and joinery, right? Uh, it also provides electrical and electronics engineer engineering. Actually, it used to just uh, narrow down uh, course to sign languages and that, but they have so far expanded. You can see they're also providing hair and beauty, uh, clothing technology, right? Uh, that's the beauty, actually, of this particular training institutes, right? So you can check also with the uh, uh, current TTI, right? If you can be able to uh, maybe visit them and enroll for those particular uh, courses. Ideally, they offer certificate and diploma courses, right? If you check on their website, you'll see those particular different courses. And uh, then we have Kabete Polytechnic. It has been there for a while, right? Uh, Kabete Polytechnic provides uh, additional technical courses that you might uh, need. So as you can see uh, from their website, they have different categories of academics. Uh, they have Institute of Hospitality, Institute of Applied Health Sciences, they also have Institute of Social Sciences and Technology, uh, Institute of uh, Engineering. So ideally, it's one pol polytechnic that comprises of different uh, institutes, which is very good. So instead of maybe looking for different uh, technical training institutes, you can always just proceed to a better a polytechnic and get all those particular institutes, right? So these are very good, and it makes it one of the best uh, technical training institute so Kenya uh, that is uh, Kabete Polytechnic and you can see it has been there for a while so once you enroll from this particular uh, institute 
of course will become marketable as you can see they have a total of um, uh, 187 courses right uh, they currently have 9300 students right and the skill trainers are 500 they have won over 30 awards right so you can visit uh, Kabete a Polytechnic for those particular courses then we have Sigalagala all the way from uh, Western right it's also a Polytechnic but they offer a uh, technical uh, courses right so if you happen to be around Western I believe one of the best uh, technical institutes or other uh, colleges or polytechnic that you need to check first is the Sigalagala right so you just need to check on the various courses from their website right and then go ahead and apply you can also apply these courses via the COPS portal right as you can see they are uh, they are affiliated to that right so uh, that is Galagala and of course we have Eldoret TTI uh, also one of the uh, best technical training institutes <coughs> that we have in the country right so as you can see it also offers quite a number of uh, technical courses uh, it has building and civil engineering ICT agriculture and animal health right so if you check on the departments you can always just uh, view the individual courses per department uh, you can also apply online right uh, the good thing with Eldoret TTI is that they provide a lot of information of, on their courses right so you can always uh, maybe uh, check uh, their various gallery right uh, they also have different campuses Bomet there's also one in Lodwa right so Eldoret is also one of the best TTIs then we have in our list also Meru National Polytechnic right so this one has been there for a while uh, quite a reputable uh, institute or rather polytechnic it also offers uh, different technical courses uh, that we have so far mentioned uh, like engineering electrical engineering courses uh, we they also provide building uh, courses right uh, those particular beauty courses there are quite a number artisan certificate diploma all these uh, courses can be found from uh, Meru so if you're around that area uh, you can check out that particular uh, college or institute uh, in our list we have uh, KIPS uh, that's another uh, college or other institute uh, that provides uh, quite a number of uh, marketable uh, courses so uh, KIPS uh, as it's famously known has been here for a while and it offers uh, these particular courses uh, they have various school school of engineering hospitality cosmetology health and applied sciences uh, the testimonials or testimonies from students uh, that have graduated from this particular institute is very very positive right so the good thing with the KIPS is that they also give priority to their students in terms of attachment. So you can always get attachment uh, from this particular, uh, once you graduate or rather before you graduate from this particular uh, institute, right? So you can see it has a l quite a number of courses that you can always enroll in, right? So KIPS is in, Niro uh, in Nairobi. So for those who are in Nairobi, you can always uh, enroll in this particular institute then you have nairobi tti <coughs> nairobi tti is very famous it has been there for a while that is nairobi technical training institute so as you can see from their website uh, they have uh, quite a number of departments mechanical and chemical engineering business studies entrepreneurship electrical and electronics automate automotive engineers so ideally, uh, Nairobi Technical Training Institute is ranked as one of the best technical institutes, right, here in the country. And if you are around, you can always uh, check with them 
for the various uh, courses that they offer. As you can see, the achievement so far is that they have uh, 54 programs. That's a lot for a TTI, right? Classes that have, they have completed is 1,867. Uh, they have enrolled so far 60, uh, 6,721 uh, students. And of course, they have certified trainers, uh, 180. So that's what makes them uh, maybe rank as the best uh, TTIs that we have. Then we proceed to the Athika uh, Technical Training Institute. Uh, this also has been uh, there for a while and it has expanded to offer different uh, courses, right? So if you look at maybe uh, the academic departments, you realize that they provide quite a number of uh, uh, programs, right? Uh, that is thicker and it also ranks as one of the best uh, TTIs. So as you can see from the numbers, uh, so far they have over 85 programs and courses. They have so far done eight graduations. Over 25,000 uh, students have graduated <laughs> from this particular TTI, which is very commendable, right? So as you can see, the departments, they have electrical and electronics department, can see agricultural engineering department applied sciences department so it's a quite a very uh, big uh, TTI right uh, that is a thicker technical training institute uh, the very best and then we have railway now as I'd mentioned these are some of the best uh, uh, training uh, institute or other colleges or polytechnics that offer uh, technical courses here in Kenya so uh, if you happen to be maybe uh, close to this institute that you are mentioning, you can always uh, enroll in one of them. And of course, we have Railway Training Institute. So here, we get quite a number of programs. They also offer short programs. They also offer different uh, courses, as you can see. They have Faculty of Engineering and Technology. They also have faculty of business and logistics, right? So they, I believe they have two campuses, one in Nairobi and uh, the other one is in uh, Kisumu, right? So uh, this particular railroad training has been there for a while. So it is well recognized. It meets uh, the accreditation that is required from the various bodies of academics, right? So you can check it out. Uh, we proceed to Rift Valley. Uh, we have Rift Valley Tra Technical Training Institute, uh, one of the best uh, technical training institutes in Rift Valley. As you can see, also they provide quite a number of uh, uh, programs, or rather they have different courses, a bit in hospitality, uh, mechanical engineering, electrical engineering, right? And they also have different production units, which is good, right? So you will have hands-on experience, uh, not only from class, but you can proceed to these production units and see for yourself uh, what happens. And of course, they have the body of uh, research, uh, which is actually good. So these are some of the things that makes uh, Rift Valley technical training uh, one of the best uh, TTIs that we have in uh, the country. So you can check out uh, this particular uh, TTI. And of course, uh, we have the famous uh, PC. I don't know why it's called PC, uh, but PC Kinyanjui uh, Technical Training Institute is also one of the uh, best technical uh, institutes that we have in Kenya. So you can see it also has different departments. Uh, let's focus on the academics. They have applied sciences, building and civil engineering, they have mechanical and automotive engineering tourism so these are the best technical courses as i'd mentioned once you pursue these particular courses from these well-known uh tti's then you there is high chances that you're going to uh, ideally start your own uh, business or you are start your own stuff right so you don't need to uh, maybe wait for employment once you have those technical skills right uh, from these particular TTIs, then you are good to go. So you can see uh, Kinyanjui has over 67 uh, courses. 
uh, they have over 3,800 uh, students and of course they have over 130 uh, lecturers. So if you're around uh, PC Kinyanjui, I think this is within a Dagoreti. You can always enroll for uh, any given uh, courses. Uh, then we have KIST, one of the best uh, science and technology institutes, right? So KIST has been there, yeah, along Kiambu Road. I think just after the DCI headquarters, their main campus is there, offering quite a number of uh, courses, right? Uh, as you can see, uh, they have uh, maybe, as you can see, they have hospitality uh, courses. And from their department, they have different departments, uh, ICT department, electrical and electronics, baking, technology, hospitality, applied sciences, mechatronics, right? These are very good courses, uh, ladies and gentlemen. For those of us who are willing to do uh, technical courses, uh, then you can also pay a visit uh, to KIST, Kiambu Institute of Science and Technology. They have over 9,000 students, right? Courses are above 75 and lecturers are 225. And they have very many venues to offer lectures, right? So you can check out with KIST and gain from the various courses that they provide. Also in our list, we talk about uh, Kisumu Polytechnic. Uh, this is uh, one of the polytechnics in the Nyanza region that is offering uh, mostly uh, marketable uh, technical uh, courses. Uh, you can see they have different uh, departments offering a variety of courses, applied science, a building and civil engineering, entrepreneurship, computer and informatics, right? So if you are in Kisumu, Kisumu City, you can check with uh, Kisumu Polytechnic uh, for some of the best uh, technical uh, courses, right? Uh, lastly, in our list, uh, we look at, sorry, uh, Martelli uh, Technical Training Institute. This is just a bonus in our list. Yeah? So it's also one of the uh, technical institutes that can always um, uh, do the technical courses or pursue the technical courses. So they have quite a number of departments, institutional management, mechanic mechanical, uh, engineering, building and civil engineering, ICT, and so on. So if you want to pursue your courses from Matili, you can also you can always check with them. Uh, this is from Western. Yeah, you can check with the Kim, uh, it's uh, found within Kimilili, right? So, uh, yes, uh, ladies and gentlemen, those are some of uh, uh, the best uh, tech technical training institutes uh, that we have here in Kenya. I know there are quite a number, but I've just sampled some of the well-known, uh, maybe because of the uh, years of uh, maybe uh, of uh, doing their work or being in business, right? But I'm not saying that they are the ones that you have not mentioned are not the best, right? So, so far, uh, we have just looked at 15. I believe there are quite a number. So if you find that there's one that we haven't really mentioned, we can share it within the comment uh, section. All right, kindly share this particular information with the rest.